Hello, hello everyone, Cole Hatter here, back again with this war of mine. When we last left off, we had created a hell of our own design and wasted all of our resources because winter had started immediately. Anyway, but we've got, who do we have here? Marco, Katya, this is her round two, her redemption round. So far she's doing fucking great. Uh, Christo, and Iskra, little Iskra. Little Iskra, my baby! I will protect her with all of my heart. Uh, Margo, you should sleep. Yeah. This is where we were when we left off, by the way. Fucked. Absolutely fucked. Uh, Iskra's sad? Why is Iskra sad? No, Iskra, go play. Go play games. Because if you're sad, then everyone else is sad. At least the child is doing okay. Yeah, she has to be happy. Because then everyone's happy. Hmm. Did I... Oh shit, we got both food things. That's good. I should probably leave them here because... Because bandits... Anyway, it's fine. Uh, we'll put them back in. And it'll be fun. And it'll be great. And it'll be fan... Yeah, it'll be fantastic. We got all the food we could possibly need. But we have no water. Because I realized we didn't make a water condenser. So Marco, you're gonna do that. Oh jeez, Iskra. Iskra's getting upset. Daddy? Uh, Daddy, I'm hungry, can I have something to eat? Uh, not now, Iskra. We're kind of bare bones on everything that's going on. All right, hang on, what do we need? Let's just look at this. For a water condenser, we need, where's my little, eh, notebook, oh God. Eh. 15 parts. What the fuck is that? Parts, that's parts. 15 comp onants, and then three parts. It's all just. It's all just stupid names. Alright, so when we go outside. Daddy, do you hear me? I'm hungry. We're working on it. It's crap. We're working on it. All right, we can't. Daddy. Very hungry, very hungry. Can you play with me, Daddy? Oh, I would love to, Iskra. So you know what? I'm going to because Marco needs to sleep. Because <laughs> he's got to go out later. Want to play a clapping game? Sure! A clapping game sounds great. It's like patty cake, I assume. Are you winning? That was fun! Yay! Let's try it again tomorrow! Woo! So this is, I guess, how she goes through her depressed thing. And he's still sick, obviously. So you can just go up there, sleep it off. What the? Stop throwing things at Marco! Why is everybody sick? Can't we do something? We're- listen, we're all in this really confined space and we can't- it, it- we're just staring at each other all day. All day, that's all we're doing. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh... Yes, girl, you wanna listen to the radio? I know you're just chilling out, but can you listen to the radio? There's things that Iskra, as a child, can and cannot do. Shortages of water. Uh, it's it's counterattacked by the rebels. Happening now, it's getting warmer. It is, that's good. Alright, so we're gonna put on the music. So everyone's mood can just be lifted. Yeah, unless we teach Iskra how to do things. Uh, like last time... We taught her how to make a water filter. She can't really do much. Like, she can make a ball, she can make a jump rope. It's fine. It's fine. But other than that, she can't do much. Unless we teach her. Marco, my head hurts. Help me. Oh. I'm sorry. Can we build another bed? Marco, do you hear me? I'm hungry. I know. You know what, Iskra? Have uh, a beef shank. It won't be much, 
but it'll make it stomach stop rumbling for the tiniest bit. No? Aren't we supposed to cook it first? Oh shit. She's gonna get food poisoning. Go play with the chalk to distract yourself from your uh, E. coli. It'll be fine. Why are you searching inside my children? Okay, so you're not hungry anymore. Or hungry, tired. <laughs> hungry and tired. Uh, can you cook? Cook. My god, what is wrong with me? Can you make another bed? No, you can't. You can make a big comfy chair, but we're not gonna do that. God damn it. What about water? Can you make some water? Nope. No water allowed. Hmm. Alright. So be sick, so be sick. Alright, I think we've got to end the day because we can't really do anything. Can't really do anything else. Okay, sleep in bed, sleep in bed, scavenge. Sleep in bed. Hmm. I'm worried about not having a guard. Abandoned cottage. Airport, lots of food, decrepit squat, semi detached house. There's people here. I'm trying to go to all the places where there's no people. Uh, warehouse, military house, but, but we've been to most places, so that's the, the problem we face. Ghost house. A man who lived here used to give shelter to people in need. He either died or fled, or his, and his home has been ravaged by mortar fire. Since then, the house stands abandoned. Neighbor kids still say he's haunted. Well, we're going. We're taking our food. We're taking a lockpick. And we're going. <laughs> we left everyone home sleeping. Hopefully the door's locked. Windows are shut. I think we've been here before. It's deserted. I don't expect to meet anyone inside. Have we been here before? Don't expect to meet anyone inside, but I feel like you will meet someone inside. Oh, yes, we have been here before, but on other various, um, playthroughs. Yep, it's a rat. It's a little squiggly rats. They're adorable. They're the best. I love them. Oh. Ooh, water. Uh. Hmm. Let me get rid of this uh lock pick. All right, there's no one in here. Yeah. Get rid of the lock pick and it'll save us a It'll save us a uh, uh what's the word? Inventory slot. Oh, <gasps> medicine. Ooh, cigarette, weapon part. Oh, a broken pistol and some weapon parts. Hmm. We could go for it. Hmm. Hmm. Let's look around some more. Let's go for it. We got... One. Oh, I almost just dropped the medicine. That would have been bad. <laughs> and then everyone will have some sort of something for when I leave them alone to go scavenging for stuff. Hello, mouse. You're adorable. I love you. Ooh. <gasps> Parts. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Right, let's see what this says. Uh, dear Serbia, just when I managed to reach this country we thought to be safe, it too was plunged into war. Don't worry though, I'm fine. I write this letter waiting for a man who can smuggle me to safety in his boat. I will then apply for the asylum, and as soon as I get it, I'll bring you here. And we'll be together again. Away from war and misery, hang on and pray for me. Kofi. Or Kofi. Whatever his name is. I don't want to mispronounce his name in, in a serious note.
right? I think here is bars. Yep, there's bars. This is just a, a nice living room. Mm. Okay. So we've got a place to come back to. A, a, a semi-safe place. A place that I think no one comes in and scares the shit out of us like they did with... Uh, <gasps> With, uh, the quiet house. Or no, old town. This is the quiet house. No, this isn't the quiet house. This is the ghost house. The ghost house! Alright, are we... No, no, I, I wanted to run to the exit. We're good here. We're good now, Marco. We're good. We carry on, Marco. Hopefully not everyone is dead by the time we get back. Only most of them. That was a really long loading screen. Uh, got the medicine. Hope it'll help. Who needs the medicine the most? Okay, they stole water filters. That's fine. Iskra got wounded. Oh no. Everyone's starving too. <sighs> it's fine. We can cook food now. Help me, Marco. I'm hurt. Oh, I'm sorry, Iskra. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm awful. I'm awful and I hate myself. I'm so- I hate myself so much that we're gonna burn this book. They're so sick and I can't help them. We can't just sit idly. We need to get food as soon as possible. My friends are dying from disease and I'm powerless to prevent it. In our basement, there lived this one large rat. The biggest rat ever. Every night he would come out of a hole in the wall, try to snatch some of our food and scuttle back in. I knew I had to try and stop him. Oh god, did this end with you getting rabies? Situation is getting dire. We need food. I know! The direst of situations! I must get meds for my friends, whatever it takes. Without meds, my friends will die. I can't let that happen. Alright. Uh, Marco, you're still up. I need you to cook for us. Shit. Cook shit for us, Marco. Damn it. Alright. Yes, girl, you sit, because it's fine. Oh look, meat. <laughs> More meat. I guess that's why Iskra's not starving, because she had that little bit of little bit of meat. Alright. Uh Oh no, we need water. We definitely need water now. Damn it! Iskra, can you feed them? You know what? Do that. Feed them. Christo, you gotta get up anyway. Someone's at the door. Who's at the door? Anyone? I need help. Who? Who, who needs help? What? Who can help? Or are you someone? Oh. Marco, I'm sorry! Alright. What do you need? Good day, dear. I lived on the street and I noticed you're living in this abandoned building. I've got some news. There was a humanitarian aid drop last night. Most containers were confiscated by the rebels, but I know about one they missed. It landed in no man's land, so it might be dangerous to get it, but under under the cover of darkness, we should be able to make it. I'll show you where it is if you help me carry supplies. Give me a sec. Okay. Daddy? It's fine. Uh... Marco, have some food just so you're not starving. Actually, can you make yourself some broth? No, you cannot. So just make yourself some of that. Have have a beef shank. It's fine. All right. Still starving. Too bad it isn't cooked. I know. Very hungry. Alright, now you're just very hungry. So go with the nice man at the door. Uh, 
Uh, yes. Alright, now... Iskra, you can sit there. It's starting to get warmer in here, which is good. Christo, need you. To build us a water condenser. Yes! Gonna put it... Where can we put it? We can put it here. We can't put it there. We've gotta put it here. Uh, place. Crystal, did your glasses just disappear or did I just have a stroke? I think I just had a stroke. Alright, it's fine though. It's fine. I also realized that I don't have a timer going on this. Well, shit. Hang on a second. I kept my old phone specifically for timekeeping purposes and I haven't even been fucking using it. <laughs> oh, alright. Resume. Thank you, sir. Sick, slightly sick. My throat is burning. I know. I know, Christo, I know. <laughs> Alright, so now you gotta put a filter in there. Just do it. Just do it, man. Just do it. It'll be fine. It'll be a fun goof. It'll be a fun gaff. What? No. Continue fucking making the thing. If wish we had proper beds and maybe a hot broth. We're working on it. Fucker. Alright. Are you hungry? You're just hungry. You're very hungry. Marco, I specifically told him to eat so he wouldn't be hungry. Okay. Alright, that's still going. Hmm, boy! Can I upgrade this or no? Just so we don't have to use as much fuel. Nope. Not even. Not a chance! Not a chance in hell! But what can we do? Uh, uh, nothing. We can specifically do nothing. For every one we use, we'll make a new one. And I think we're just gonna have to end the day here. We might just have to end the day here. Let's do it. We'll have uh, Christo on guard. Have those two sleep. Because we really can't do anything else. He's feeling much better. Christo is pale and coughing all the time. He looks severely sick. Alright, he's severely ill now, so you get the medicine. And you get the medicine, and you get the medicine, and Iskra's depressed! It's good to have a child around, but heartbreaking to see it unhappy. It. It. <laughs> we can- we can just fucking- Did you smack my microphone? What's the just say they! Them! It's heartbreaking to see them unhappy! Ugh. It. Oh my goodness. Alright, Iskra, go play, um, hopscotch. It should cheer you up. Alright, Katya is sick recovering. Well, she's not gonna be recovering soon. It's getting cold. It's the right dose for the day. And Katya, you should get up, sit in that chair, and then... Christo... Go to sleep. You can... Sleep it off a bit further. I uh, know I don't want to play now. Ah, oh, shit. Katya, talk to Iskra. Do it, nerd. Oh, wait. First, go set up a water filter thing. All right, we've got a few things of water now. That's good. That's good. We're on the right track. Sort of. Kind of. All right, Iskra's back to being very hungry. Again, sweetie, we're working on it. Right. Did anyone have anything to say about helping the guy with the... With the drop? Did he give us anything and I just didn't notice it? Did he got us coffee. Katya drinks coffee, so her mood should improve slightly. 
What are you doing, Daddy? You don't have time, do you? Franco! Franco, Franco, Franco! Franco, just the guy I want to see. I don't know what I need, though. What do I need from you? Uh... Uh, medicine might be it. Bullets? No, we don't really have anything to give you except for these things. Uh, what do I want for it? How about... some boards? Maybe some water? Nope. Uh... Deal. Alright. Uh, now, you should probably leave Franco, because I don't think we have anything, uh, that you would want. <laughs> Someone came to us. Oh. Oh, she's crying. Iska's crying. <laughs> Iska! Come on, can I talk to you? I'm hungry, Katya. Can I have something to eat? Sure, honey, I'll make you something to eat. Oh, God. Come on, cheer up. Hugs. Hug it out. Hug it out like you like each other. Hey, Iskra, don't be so blue. I'm here for whatever you- for whenever you need me. What's wrong? Oh, Iskra. Iskra, sweetie. I know. I miss my friends. Oh. <laughs> I even miss going to school. Damn, you know she's depressed. You know a kid is depressed when they're like, I want to go to school. The war will end quickly. You'll see. It will. In like- 30 days this. You promise? Yep. I promise. We just have to wait. Come on, Iskra. Come on. Come on. Be happy again. Okay, so when she's depressed, she doesn't feel like playing games. Is it? We're just gonna... We're still talking? Okay. Oh, water filter's done. Alright, and now Marco is just tired. Alright, how are you doing? Okay, Iskra, now you're just sad, so go play some games. Uh, Katya, listen to the radio. Uh, music. Fight these more counter attacks. Same thing. Uh, beware of bands of looters roaming the city. It's best to lock your doors and stay inside. Well, shit. Classical music that we can't listen to. It's our pleasure to report that the next couple of days are expected to be quite warm. Woo! Oh, same thing. It's like a thing in between things. No, okay. There we go. Music. It's getting worse day by day. Shut up! You don't know nothing! You don't know anything! Alright. What can you do? Uh, it could be better, but at least the child is doing okay. Okay! Because once Iskra's upset, everyone's upset. I can't have Iskra upset. Ooh, fuel or water filter? Oh no, I thought they were with the same thing. Oops. It's fine. Not a good day. Shut your face. Shut your pie hole. All right, but if everyone mood if everyone's mood gets too bad, we can always go to the hospital. Hospital. And start digging around. We'll send Katya there if she ever starts to feel better. It's sad when everyone is hungry. I know. Go play with that. We had proper beds and maybe some hot broth. We're working on it. Alright. We can send Katya to the hospital. <gasps> That's right! We can send everyone to the hospital for treatment! Oh, boy! I completely forgot about that! Oh my god! I just... 
straight hair get out of it. I completely forgot that we could take people to the hospital specifically for treatments. Holy shit. So even if we don't have meds. Oh no, dude. Go back to sleep. What does such things happen to children? It's fine. Iskara, when did you become slightly sick? Uh, okay. Oh, day's running down. So we can... Marco, we're gonna have you guard. We're gonna have Crystal and Iskra sleep. Hmm, should we try for one more day? One more day of everyone who needs to sleep sleeping? Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll have one more night of everyone sleeping, chilling out, and then we'll send Katya out. Please don't be raided. We were raided. Katya's starving. Everyone's starving. Everyone's starving. Crystal was wounded, but the attackers didn't steal anything. Well, shit. God damn it. One day, our attendant was hit by a shell. We survived, but our neighbors were less fortunate. Their basement collapsed, burying them underneath lots of rubble. We managed to pull out our neighbor and her son, but her husband was crushed. Iskra saw his mangled body and has had horrible nightmares ever since. Crap! Alright. Marco. Can you make us some of food? Can you make us some of food? Make that. Uh, Iskra, can you set up a water filter? Oh, you're depressed again. Oh, Iskra, I'm so sorry. And she's slightly sick. And she's very hungry, so she's going to be. Well, you're not. You're not severely ill anymore, Christo. So you've got that going for you at least. Maybe someone can teach me how to use it. Um. Yo, Marco, go up there and teach her how to use this. I know you're sad, I know you're tired, I know you're starving. And then you can cook. Uh, I don't feel safe here. I hope those men don't come back. It's fine. Alright. Katya, make us some food. Alright. Now, Marco. Teach? Can I teach her how to do it? I can! Teach Iskra! Iskra is unwell. In this state, she won't learn much shit. Well, that's a another thing for another time, I guess. We'll do that later. Alright, 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 alright. It's alright, sweetie. You're alright. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. I'm terribly hungry. I know. Everyone. Soup's on, everyone. Right. Got here. You have first, and then you can feed everyone else. Because you're really good at cheering everyone up. All right. Hey, Iskra, you have to eat food. Uh huh. All right, now you're not hungry anymore. All right, that's good. All right, now feed him. Can you listen to the radio? All right, music. I'm just checking this every day, just in case. Just in case. Classical music. Warm days. Get that sick bass line going, yo. Right. Marco, how you doing? You're back to very hungry. Why don't you sleep? And then feed Christo. Goddamn, Christo, you have been indisposed this entire time. I don't think I've seen you up from that bed once. Come on, don't give up. You gotta eat. You gotta get your nutrients and your vitamins and your minerals and all that shit. Shut up, Nugget. You didn't see anything. 
Nugget, I swear to whatever god your messed up family believes in, if Nugget fell down- if Lily fell down that hole you dug, I'm pushing you in after her. Nugget will not give the teacher the satisfaction. Nugget- teacher will never take Nugget alive! What a weird, uh, turn of events that there's no medical supplies here at the hospital. Uh... Okay. I don't know what to make of that. 